This new plane should work a lot better. Man, I, I hope so. Most of the problems. Wait, you did? When did you iron so, out those problems? I was here the whole time. Do your stuff. I, I mean, how? Really? I seen this whole time he was just there trying to collect the emerald. He was defeating chaos and stuff. When did he iron out the problems? Ah, oh, these plot holes. Anyway, there's what appears to be a tail. Oh, what is this inside the mountain behind the waterfall? Next to where we fought Chaos 4. Woo! No, wait, this, this, wait, pardon me, this isn't actually where it is. That, uh, I'm thinking of something else, never mind. <laughs> I don't know, I'm always thinking of something else in this walkthrough. That goes to show how much I know the actual adventure portion of Sonic Adventure. But the Sky Chase Act 2 is coming up. You know how this went before. And the camera's gonna go buggy again. Yay! I hope you're here for the commentary and not the camera quality. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I guess this is where Tails meets up with Sonic at Red Mountain. Otherwise, Sonic would have been just, like, sitting there in the middle of nowhere for some reason. Evidently, he didn't even pop that capsule over there to release the animals. I don't know why he didn't do that. I mean, didn't he do that on his side of the story to end the stage or something like that? Oh, uh, it makes sense. To, oh, never mind. Uh, uh, I guess Sonic doesn't care about freeing the uh, other wildlife. I guess he only cares about Tails and Knuckles and maybe even Amy. I don't know. Actually, there, there was some hints about Sonic uh, starting to like Amy in some uh, things. Uh, but I'm not going to go into the details because this is Sky Chase Act 2. More flying, more shooting and uh, stuff. And uh, yeah... There's not really much you can say about a flying shooter. I mean, you can make some Star Fox references, like do a barrel roll or use the boost to get through, but you can't even do a barrel roll to my knowledge, and you can't even use the boost to get through as this is all just like an automated section. So, yeah. Not really much to commentate on four times playing Sky Chase Zone, so uh, yeah, completely ignore the uh, glowing icons and score there from the camera quality, of course, uh, if you want to be focusing on the ship as well as the plane that I'm flying here, as well as whatever I'm locking on to, so you know where to be locking on to yourself. Um, there's going to be some stuff shooting at me after I get up to the top of the ship, if I'm not mistaken. Um, it should be coming up very shortly. There it is! Yeet. Oh, I took a hit. I dodged at the wrong corner. Poopers. Yeet. I think I got nicked right there. Oh, poopers. Oh, oh, they're go it's go bullets are going a little bit fast there for my liking. And bullets are kind of painful. You think after... So so oh, little cutscene. You know what you're doing. You and transform now! Woo! Oh, that was so fancy. I guess now it's like more aerodynamic or something like that. I don't know. It never made much sense how Tails is playing to change, change shape for whatever reason. It doesn't seem to uh, even need to uh, change shape. I mean, all planes fly basically the same way um, when you fly by propeller. I mean, if you think about it, because... The idea with flying with the plane through propeller and wings like that is to go fast enough to get air underneath the wings to lift up the plane and keep it stable with the tail wing and stuff like that. So I don't know what's the purpose of having those split four wings when it's basically going to do the same thing. If not, it maybe even make it a little more unstable perhaps. I'm not exactly positive of, or sure of all the dynamics of a plane. I'm just uh, going through the facts of how a plane flies and stuff like that. And uh, might I add that besides flying underneath the egg carrier like what I'm doing right now, planes are actually one of the safest forms of transport ever. Safer than even driving. So, um, yeah. I don't... Uh, so... <coughs> The people that are like, oh boy, I'm a little nervous about flying. Well, it's kind of understandable because you're thousands of feet in the air, but uh, uh, it's, it, I'm 
never flown myself, but I know how, how extremely safe they are because of... Whoa, oh, the lasers! Now, I just thought I would go through those uh, fun facts there. I'm not actually much of a traveler myself, and as a matter of fact, I'm more of the kind of person who likes to just relax at home on vacation if I were to have any vacation or something like that. So, uh, yeah, I'll just explain how you know, things are going along with me, and yeah, I just blew, blew up the ship there, so... Yeah, you know how that goes. You've seen me blow up the ship before. I'm just talking random stuff right now, just to fill out the commentary, because, uh, there is absolutely no, no, nothing going on here, and Sonic the Hedgehog was added to the list. What could that mean? Actually, I kind of forgot what that means. Hmm. I, yeah, I really did forget what that means, so uh, anyway, we're coming in for a landing again, and... Uh, and uh, I bet you we forgot the landing gear. Oh no! I thought you said you worked out all the bugs. What were you doing on that adventure outside your workshop? Uh, I mean, evidently he works on his bugs outside the workshop. But no, whatever. This thing is really. Run the egg carrier! Yay! The ship is actually pretty impressive, I gotta say. It's pretty fun to explore, which I will be doing later on some other people's adventure. Whoa, 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 whoa. I just realized I need like eight more minutes of footage to fill out the parts. I, I, I was kind of like completely forgetting about the, um, the whole uh, time limit thing on YouTube, and I kind of like made a 20 minute part. So, uh, I'm just gonna have to split it up into uh, two 15 minute parts. So, whoopsie doodle. I, yeah, so now he's gonna do his uh, ship transforming thingy again. The Transformers more than meets the eye. Haha, <laughs> I used that joke before. And the wings flip around. I have no idea how that does that mid flight because, as I said, part of how a plane flies in mid air is. Uh, I mean, I should say, uh, it is how a plane flies in air with wings like that, is when it has enough speed and it has to have the air going underneath the wings for lift. I don't get how he's able to flip, up the, flip around those wings in midair like that. Amazing. So anyway, now I gotta go over to the sky deck. You remember the sky deck? Of course you do. I love the sky deck. Of course, this is a much shortened version of the sky deck, and of course the cutscene. Oh, it didn't show tails flip around on that little slope like it did before, or I should say like Sonic did before. So this is stage four. Sky deck. Wish me luck. Here we go. Uh, yeah, I gotta once again race Sonic. This is probably the easiest Sonic race in the game because you can fly and woof. <laughs> Pardon me for a second there, I just kind of brain farted there. Um, because you can fly around obstacles and stuff like that, and take pretty humongous shortcuts just like that, while Sonic has to climb around them the long way, and the platforms are going to get shot away from behind Sonic and stuff like that, and yeah, you get the idea. So, Tails has a huge, huge advantage over Sonic being able to fly, uh, so... Yeah, poor Sonic. Look how far behind he is. Aww. I would almost feel sorry for him, but nah, since I'm facing off against him, I kind of don't. So let's just beat his booty by going up these weird, uh, I don't know, the zigzag platforms there. I don't know why they just didn't put a ladder over there like they did at other places. I would think a ladder would be more cost effective in terms of material than a, um, then a whole weird, uh, not, I can't, I can't even call it a spiral staircase, it's more like a catwalk of some sort, and don't even bother flying on, I mean, don't even bother touching that thing, just go right across there and go, oh, right across there, and, uh, yeah, another speed boost in midair for Tails, just look how much of an advantage Tails has over Sonic, it's just, holy poopers, and look, there's a shortcut that I can take right here, I can just cut through the whole thing, without any trouble whatsoever, hit the capsule and end the stage. Sonic is way, way behind me. Poor Sonic. He is no longer the fastest thing alive. <sighs> I feel kind of sorry for him. That wasn't too bad. Hmm. 
I, for, I just remembered, I kind of forgot to uh, adjust the white balance for the camera. I hope that doesn't mess up things too. I was kind of in a hurry to start up doing another part, but it yeah. looks like it's holding up fine right now. Is that it? Sonic, we should check out the bridge. Yeah, definitely. So, uh, hold on a sec, please. Okie dokie. So, to the bridge we go. And, uh, yeah, we just press this thingy right here. And, oh, I should actually... Uh, no, I'll show that another time. I, I don't really... F it's, it's it's another chow garden, which is on the egg carrier. Uh, I believe you can get to it from that room. But anyway, going outside here, uh, I'm gonna have to go find the, uh, way to, uh, transform the ship back to what it was before, and I'm pretty sure you know how to... Oh, I, or maybe it's gonna be a boss battle or something. Sonic, yeah, whatever. <laughs> you're a bit late. No, you're never too late. Oh, poor birdie, not a... Uh -oh. Why is that birdie holding a Chaos Emerald anyway? Seriously. Well, at least he releases the bird after he's done with her. No, not Gamma, oh, poopers. Actually, it's E-102 Gamma to you, Eggman. Please don't tell me I'm gonna have to face one of the easiest bosses ever again. Or am I? I mean, come on. I'm tired of these easy bosses. Seriously. Yep, looks like I will be. Well, I can take full advantage of the rhythm badge in this one by constantly spinning through the whole battle. Well, at least when I get close to that gamma there, so... This battle should go even fat. well, maybe not quite as fast as I did with Sonic and the- Oh, look, you took a hit! And, uh, oh, oh, wait a second, oh, 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 you landed right into my tail! Oh, 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 you took another hit, oh, look at that, you're done! <laughs> Isn't that sad? It's just so sad I have to feel sorry for that robot. He does have that lock on- a lock-on shooty attack thingy dealio thing, but that's kind of useless, as you've seen right there, because all I have to do is just keep moving, and the bullets will just miss me completely. All right. Why well, I, I would like to hurt him, but, eh. Okay, if you say so. See, this, this cutscene is happening with Tails and not Sonic, so... It's, it's kind of odd to see that happening. <laughs> After watching the Sonic story. Why is the ship losing altitude anyway? I always wondered this. Nothing happens to the ship. It's it's in the original form it was before. It was po it was flying just fine airborne before. Maybe it's because I blew things up in the sky deck? I don't know. It certainly doesn't look like I blew up anything vital at the sky deck. It, I mean, his own cannons were blowing up just some platforms. But they weren't exactly blowing up like propellers and stuff like that, or those rockets at the edge of the ship or something. I don't know. It makes no sense whatsoever. See, now why is the ship blowing up? That makes no sense again. I didn't do anything to the ship. Ugh. Maybe the rock and battle between Chaos 6 and Sonic, you know, that lasts like a minute or so, uh, destroyed the ship because it was so epic? I don't know. Uh -oh, we're back at Station Square here, and uh, let's see what's going on. And now uh, I guess uh, we're dropping Amy off here, because you can evidently carry something that's your size, you know, with just your tails flapping about like so, through the air without much trouble staying in the air. And there goes Eggman! Oh, poor Eggman! Wait a second, shouldn't I go chase after him? I think I should. That's Eggman! I wonder what happened to Sonic? Uh, obviously that was Eggman, but the- Whoa! Poopers, he's nose down. Oh, poor Eggy. I'm finished. Chaos was defeated, and now my egg carrier is ruined. No oh matter. well. I will destroy Station Square anyway. What? How? You don't have chaos. How will you destroy Station Square without chaos? Tell me! Wait, why did you just sit down there, Tails? 
I know you didn't fall on your own. I mean, come on. Uh-oh. 